at freight so we have just created the invoice header added two lines and the corresponding details at both the header level and line details we'll simply add some freight amount you can add the freight at the line level or at the header level okay so let's go back uh, to fusion cloud and check out this all right so i'm back at oracle fusion cloud so if you want to add the freight at the header level here you can see a column called as uh, freight right so if you edit this here you can choose the carrier the ship date the fob shipping reference basic freight information and then you can add the freight amount for the entire order so for the entire lines which are in this particular invoice alternatively you can simply go to each particular line like this and you can click on something called as edit freight button and that will let you add the freight for an individual line so let's add freight for each of the line so let's say DHL is the carrier ship date let's say we're gonna ship it today only any shipping reference any FOB leave it if you don't know the details uh, there is no list of values to validate it from because this is just an invoice however if you were entering it or if you were coming from uh, auto management then there you will have a list of values from where the FOB the carrier will get validated okay so here I'm gonna say the freight is say $20 for this particular line and then I'm gonna hit the OK button so as you could see the freight at that line level got added right then I'm gonna click on this particular line and again I'm gonna click on edit freight so again you see here you have an option for adding freight for the entire transaction or individual transaction lines so the first part I have demonstrated to you was for the entire transaction now I want to add it individually for the second line so it says that selecting a different freight application will delete the existing entries do you want to continue because we want to enter it at the line level it's deleting the entries at the header level okay so we'll add it at the line level by selecting individual transaction lines then I'm going to choose the transaction line let's say line number two and what's the amount in line number two let's say it's something like forty dollar okay and then I'm going to add line number one and choose line number one and here I'm going to say the amount as twenty dollar okay so a total freight amount of sixty dollar gets added and hit the OK button and as you could see the total freight at the line level got added automatically and summed up at the header level so at this point I'm going to simply go and hit the save button to save my transaction details mm -hmm.